to another video. <laughs> and today's video is, um, <laughs> um, so yeah, I know you guys are seeing the background right now, and I, I and I'm very sorry about this game. I, I know, I know, I know. Um, I I lost disinterest into this game too, but we are actually checking out a mod, and it is a nuclear mod. I did want to do a World War II mod. I know that sounds really weird, but. As I am explaining it to you guys, uh, so this is what you guys are going to need if you guys want to make these nuclear bombs. So you need a rod, um, nuclear rods, you need a hydrogen rod, and then we will need the redstone rod, but a bit later. Um, actually, we're going to probably skip that one. It doesn't do nothing. To me, it doesn't. I mean, yeah, I mean, to me, it really doesn't do nothing. Then we're going to need the nuke top and the nuke bottoms, and we already heard the explosion. And what is that? Nuclear. Anyways. And we are going to need an antenna. I'm using uh, TMI for uh, to get um, unlimited. And we are going to need a time bomb. A time bomb. And then we're going to need a fuse. And then we're going to need a chip. And I know you guys are probably hearing my um, keyboard right now, but that's fine. And then a some pliers. I know that's crazy, isn't it? Um, so, uh, so this is okay. So, um, I'm gonna show you guys the small bomb right now in the desert right here. Uh, this is the smallest one, and you just need a top and a bottom like that in a line right here, and then bam, and it says whack nuke, and uh, that's pretty funny to me, I guess. So you're just gonna need some nuclear rods, which I guess that makes how much two two point whoa megatons. Okay, and we get that, and we get the chip, and you are going to need a time bomb to explode, and you have 25 seconds to run away. I mean, I, I don't know if you're going to survive uh, in survival. This is their, like, creative things and stuff like that. So this is pretty much, uh-oh, I forgot I had my speakers on. <laughs> this thing's going to be loud if I don't have my speakers. So we have uh, 10 seconds left, and we should be able to go ahead and see this explode and anytime oh there it goes and there oh my god there we go it is exploding and I think everything around it is gonna die even the cactuses look at there's a dead bush and it's dead and this is mind you this is the smallest one everybody this is like the smallest one that they have I mean, it's not the, uh, the suckiest one. The suckiest one uses the redstone rods. I didn't know what the redstone rods were, but yeah, this is the, these are the only one, two ones I know, I know of. So, yeah, wow, it makes a big crater just like this. Uh, I hope I am recording, and you guys found some diamond right here. Wow. So we do have the nuclear waste coming off there, and then we have a huge crater right here. Good way to mine if you guys don't die. But this is the smallest one that they have out. Okay, this is the smallest one that they have. Um, there's a bigger one called the Tazar Bomba. I don't know what the hell you call that. Um, which is in real life would take out New York, and the radiation would spread great, greatly somewhere else in real life. Um, but uh, yeah, let's hope the FBI don't come through my door. Uh, I'll just say I'm playing some Minecraft, but. <laughs> Um, but for real, uh, so if you guys want to make the big one, I mean, there is another one, um, there, it's like, it's like this, completely like this, but I'm not sure what this one does. All I know is you need a, right there, and all I know is you need a red stone rod, and I'm not sure what it does, but we're gonna, I'm gonna show you guys it anyways. Uh, to me, it doesn't do nothing, um for real like I can't find any I can't find out what this one does if you I got rid of my antennas well if you guys know what this does in the uh, description below or <laughs> what if you guys know what this does tell me in the comments down below if you guys like play this game or something like that uh, let me know down in the comments below on what this one does because I have no idea but we're gonna keep an eye on what it, where it's at I'm gonna keep an eye over on that that way over there where it's facing because it doesn't seem like it doesn't it doesn't to me it doesn't seem like it does anything so 10 seconds left on the nuclear clock yes I'm sorry if this is cringy guys I'm very sorry uh that's all it does 
What was that? Like, I, I ha- I, it, Whoa. Like, what does this do, guys? Like, I have no idea. To me, it doesn't do nothing. I mean, hey. If we want to see some destruction right here, we will make the the good old uh, big one right here, which you need two, four in a row of ba uh, bottoms and two, uh, um, four in a row of tops. And you guys click, left click, by the way, I'm sorry if I didn't, you left click and then you get the big old czar, the, the czar, the, I don't know how to pronounce it. We're going to get a uh, screenshot here. Uh, I'm not sure how to get a screenshot. Hold up. Alright, so this is what you do. So you go in here, you see the, the hit box right here. And this is the Sar Bomba. They call it Sar, I'm not pretty sure. Um, so you get some uh, 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 hydrogen rods and some nuclear rods and put them in there just like that. And we have 50 megatons. Wow, that in real life would kill everybody. And we get a chip. I wish it would stop duplicating. And we go ahead and grab a antennas and uh, and we have a fuse. Now you guys want to be out of the area before this blows up or you're going to lose your house and probably your life in this game because uh, it is a pretty big um, one. All these, like that butterfly over there, whatever that bird is going to be dead. All these things are going to be dead and we have 10 seconds left. What is this? I don't know, but we have we have 10 seconds left and we are sh it should explode in any time right now And there we go. You guys are probably hearing that on my speakers. I gotta turn that down Yeah, I'm sorry about that. I am not using headphones right now, but it's fine I'll go ahead and turn that down. You guys are probably hearing this. I hope you guys can hear me And if you guys can So this is the Sarbamba. It's Actually, I mean, it's, it looks better than the other one, and it disappeared, and if I go next to it, it's going to re-explode because I went out of the area. But, yeah, it does that. So, big old explosion. Probably one of the biggest ones that they have so far. I don't know if they have any other nuclear bombs out. I'm not sure if they're going to update it. I'm pretty sure if they were going to update uh, Rival Rebels mod, they would have already. Um... And it would have been 1.13 and not 1.7. By the way, if you guys want to download this mod, download Forge uh, Forge 1.7.10 and download this. And they have the thing um, down there. I'll leave a link if you guys want to download this in the below. Um, if you guys are new to this, uh, make sure you don't um, click anything on AdFly. AdFly uh, will give you a virus. So, yeah, this is pretty much it. Uh, they have um, Scorch blocked. And wow, it is perfect if you guys want to make a Fallout 4 map. I'm just saying. If you guys want to make a Fallout 4 map? There you go. Um, they do. Ha it does have some. I mean, if you stand on these scorch blocks, you will die. Um, like, I guess if you uh, grab, I don't know, grab a, let's grab a, a pig here, I guess. And the pig might not die. I'm not sure. The pig might be immortal. And the pig does not want to be there. Well. I don't want to crash, so yeah, that's pretty much the, in fact, that is probably the video concluded. I'm just saying that this is, I mean, if you guys want to do this, um, I guess it, it doesn't really take a too much computer power. I mean, have a, a pretty good one, but not too much of a good one. I mean, because it does um, blow up slowly and it, it loads in slowly, just like normal, like a normal game. But that is pretty much the end of the video. If you guys, so yeah, thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys want to see more uh, videos like this, let me know down in the comments below. And uh, yeah, thank you everybody so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.